I think overall the budget is a very positive document which has been presented by the finance minister. What I liked about it was that he's covered every citizen in the country. If you look at the first part of his speech, he focused about the common man. He talked about how to make it inclusive. And in the course of his speech, he talked about the benefits he's giving to every individual, especially those below the poverty line. In terms of his approach to the common man, he talked extensively about how every village should have water, power, um, uh, medical facilities, schools should be within five kilometers, roads should be made available. And I think for the first time, someone has come up and said there should be a social security net, there will be health insurance available, there will be accident insurance available. I think these are great directions which will help people across the board. But these services are provided at a very, very low cost. Pension is something he wants to build up again. He's given substantial deduction to build up a pension fund for the individual, which is long-term security. On the corporate side, I think the focus towards growth is extensive. Infrastructure is getting a lot of focus. He's talking about REITs and tax benefits thereon. He's talked about tax rate reduction, which is positive in terms of attracting investments into the country. I think overall, the movement towards tax simplification, easing of processes and systems, skilling, focus on make in India. I think all this is very positive to really carry uh, the economy forward. And I liked his closing where he said we want change, we want growth and we want jobs. I think that is really what India needs. So it's a very positive budget and we support it in CII wholeheartedly.